Hey guys, this is Joe Tech from Joe Tech Tips. We're on Facebook and Twitter. And this is the path to repairing Malwarebytes 3.3.1. I have no idea what the hell they did. What you need to do is make sure that you have your Malwarebytes premium serial number. I uninstalled it, but it it really didn't uninstall because it didn't say activate license. Say web protection. This was all still active and it, and it kept my serial number. What you need to do, I, I think this is good, I'm going to say this now. You need to uninstall the program so it prompts you for your serial number. It needs to be in a free state. It cannot remember your credentials. It cannot remember your your serial number for Malwarebytes. You must completely remove it to the point where it's actually in the free trial. That's where it has to be. If you do not have it in that, the reinstall will not work. And it looks like I nailed it. This is good news. This is really good news. Normally it fails over and over and over again, but this is good. I think I freaking fixed it. <laughs> what a pain in the ass. All right, so remember that. It must be in the trial mode. Otherwise, it will not be fixed. It cannot. Oh, this is good. Very good. This video will be up shortly. Tiger Shark 1968, I am so sorry for your infection. Hopefully, you see this video. Um, yes, I agree. Um, <laughs> you should be able to go anywhere you want on the internet and not worry about getting Trojans and stuff like that. Uh, Marrowbytes makes a program. It's called Adware Cleaner. <coughs> Download this. This is a very, 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 very good program on top of Marrowbytes. So if you have a Trojan and stuff, use this first and then go to Marrowbytes. Great thing. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Take care. We'll see you next time. Creative Labs iRaw. Plug it in like, like this. The inside of this is really impressive. 100A in the Prius. The AC adapter, one amp charger, and it's big, and it's made out of aluminum. Okay, as you can see, the backup is complete. Like so. Now you can create the RAID array. I mean, for, for, the, for the price difference between the two,